Hey, this is Jules. I am real tired today, but I have been nudged all day to do a recording, so here I am. Let's see who comes in. I am the Cosmic Isis, and I come forward now with many, many beings of light known on the earth plane as goddesses, carrying forth the energy of the divine feminine creation powers. It is now time as we move into the year 2021 for the rebirth of the divine feminine to come forward into the hearts of many women, men, whatever gender people choose, it is not necessary to be identified as a female on the physical plane for this opening to occur. We are now seeing the death rose, the stamping of the feet of the men who want to hold on to their power. And yet it is time for that age of light, if we may call it that, on the physical plane to be complete. There is a great gentleness in our power, but I come forth with the power straightforward in this recording. Many have called upon divine justice, divine peace, divine assistance over the past few months as transitions begin to take place in many countries around the world, exemplified by the recent election series in the United States. And it is still valid to call forth the assistance of beings of light who will anchor justice and truth on the physical plane. But know this, you must call that forth within you if you are to anchor that. So you must clear your energetic bodies. You must stand in your integrity and your power and call forth the complementary energies of your multidimensional self and those beings of light who work with you and through you. For many of you, you are moving into an expansion and a realization of yourself as a multidimensional being, and so your work in the coming year will be focused on that opening. There are many women in particular who will move into an empowered embodiment in the next year and moving forward for the next five years. It is your time and you have chosen to be embodied at this time, so stand tall. Recognize your divinity. Own your worth. And call in the assistance of all the beings of light who, with, who work with you in your expanded self. Ground this light into the center of the planet in honor of the great blessings that the Mother gives you for all aspects of your life on this physical plane. For those of you wanting to move more into an expression of your love, your love for the planet, your love in relationships, your love as an expression of your creativity, that will come forward as part of the opening into the divine feminine creation energies. You may also call upon the energy of the Aquarian force, the Aquarian realm, the altered dimensional state that is setting the energetic template upon the planet now. But we come forward now to remind you that you have worked with all of us who are present, and it is many. You have worked with us many times. You have called us forth in partnership, in sisterhood. And we honor that previous calling and come forward now to continue that bonding, that expression. The Divine Sophia, the primal creative source energy expressed in the feminine creation codes, is coming forth on the planet now as blankets of light and love, encircling the planet 
you might find yourself enraptured with it, opening to these aspects of self that you had forgotten. And if this is so, we ask that you focus on expressing that through some type of creation. For that is when the energy completely blooms, and that is the intent of this wave coming upon the planet now. The regenerative force, the creative opulence of the Divine Feminine will take hold on this planet now. Yes, there will be remnant instances of the dying patriarchal societies trying to claim their space but it will not last. And this is not to say, again, that leaders who come forward at this time cannot be masculine. That is not the point of this at all. Do not distract yourself with mental gymnastics, trying to argue the minutia of what it is that we are conveying at this time. Instead, bask in the power that I carry forth now. I hold you in this light to help you stand tall and remember you are truly divine. You have chosen to be here now for this specific time, for specific reasons. There are many, many watching, many watching the expressions of embodiment expansions on this planet now. You are at the edge of the expansion of creation. So honor that. If there are parts of you that are fearful of being seen, simply turn away while you create. Enter into a sacred silence. Create a inner garden for creative exuberance. Whatever it takes, honor this flow. It will astound you in its power and its grace and its love. We are honored and blessed to be able to come forward in support of you now. So call upon us, whatever names you use from whatever cultural traditions you have. We will be here. We are here. We hold you in our light now with such camaraderie, such friendship, such power, and we bless you with it. So be it, and so it is done. This Jules, I really love it when Isis comes in like that, man. She is just glorious. So I'm going to lean into that. I'm going to call on that. It is exactly what I have been calling forth to help me ex express my creativity more. I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for listening.